this project i'll be using a 4.5 millimeter hook um a dani needle my scissors and um of course my yarn so first we are going to start with making um a slip knot yes we're going to start with making a slip knot i wanted my my yarn to be a little bit thicker so i'm going to be doubling the yarn so first we're going to make a slip knot like this then chain then chain so from here we are going to chain and um, we're going to make a chain of 35 so we're going to go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen so we are done with our 35 chains and so to start um row one we are going to be adding one more chain and we are going to make nine single crochet in the next nine stitches excluding the first one that we made a chain so we are just going to insert our hook into the second chain yarn over we have two loops yarn over put through so we have made our first single crochet we're going to go into the second one and make another single crochet like this This is four and five, then six, seven, eight, nine. So we've done nine, we made nine single so from this point we are going to be making um the next 17 chains we are going to be making double crochet on it so to make double crochet you yarn over insert your hook into the next um chain yarn over put two we are going to have three stitch yarn over put you two yarn over put you two so for the next 17 chains we are going to, um 16 chains we already made one we're going to be making um double crochet so we are done making um 17 um double crochet and in um last nine um chains we are going to be making single crochet so we just go with single crochet for the last um nine chains so we are done with um row one and at the end we are we have um about 35 35 stitches just like we have that we had 35 um 35 chains so you can make yours longer i mean adding more chains when you started but i just prefer mine like this so to begin row two we're going to chain one turn your work and we're going to be starting with single crochet like the way the previous one was so what we are going to do is um uh, make single crochet but this time around we are going to be working the back loop only like this like this we are going to be working in the back loops only
going to um make nine single crochet until we get to this point here so now i am done making um nine single crochet for the second row remember we are working back loops only so now i'm going to start with double crochet like we did in the previous row and i'm going to be making seven 17 at, as well so i'm just going to yarn over and make um double crochet in the next 17 um stitches back loops only So I am done making 17 double crochet and I am left with um, 9 more stitches and of course we are going to be making single crochet in this 9 last stitches back loops only so just going to make single crochet. So I have gotten to the end of row 2 um, and in row 3, what I did in row 2, that's what I'm going to be repeating and in row 4, row 5 till the last row we are going to be making and if you feel like, if you feel this um, size is too small, you can as well add more chains, just make sure that, um, I mean more chains when you start there, just make sure that the um amount of single crochet you make at the both sides are equal that's what matters and from here i'll be making i'll be proceeding to row row three and i'm just going to be doing exact exact same thing so at the end of um i don't know how many rows i'll be making but at the end of that particular row i am going to tell you Look at the area. Um, we made a total of um, 11 rows, so from this point, all we need to do now is to make the um, the strap at, at the both side. So, first we are going to insert our hook like this and make a chain of about 26 chains. I ended up making a total of um, 28 chains because I I realized that was what was going to be perfect for it. So from this point, all we need to do is um slip stitch at this at this edge here. So just going to insert our hook like this and make a slip stitch. Like that so all we need to do is um continue continue making slip stitch to the probably the fifth row um the, the on the next um five um stitches like this
like this and for me i'm just going to um make one more chain and then we're going to cut the yarn So we are going to make it for this point also. Mm -hmm. 